FriendFinder Networks is a social networking and technology company. Uh, it is also the parent company of Penthouse Magazine. FriendFinder Networks CEO Mark Bell is with me. He says investors should be comparing the company more to LinkedIn and Facebook. However, the stock has dropped almost 60 percent since its IPO on May 11th. Mark, great to have you with us, and you can't be happy about that. Uh, we're very unhappy about it. I mean, we look at ourselves as we're a software company. We build software platforms. Uh, just like a LinkedIn, we build the software. Consumers provide the content. Yet we're trading at a fraction of everybody else's multiple, and we're not sure why. You're not sure why? You're really not sure why? Come on. Well, if you look at it, think about how big, how big we are. 350 million of revenues, 100 million of EBITDA. So it's almost twice the EBITDA of LinkedIn. At the end of the day, it's about making money. You know, we have three times the traffic of a LinkedIn, three times the membership base, 445 million registrants across 38,000 websites in over 200 countries. That's big, by any metric. By all those financial metrics, yes, I don't dispute that. But of course, your content is adults-only content. It's radioactive to half of Wall Street. Actually, it's totally not true. If you look at our top 22 websites, 17 of our top 22 websites are general audience websites. Things like bigchurch.com, amigos.com, asiafriendfinder.com are all general. All we do is build the software. Consumers drive the content. It's not our content, but we allow consumers to put up there what they would like to, whatever, however they want to express themselves. Mm -hmm. But if you look at our top 22 websites, more than, more than three quarters of them our general audience websites How just like Facebook. How much do they contribute to the revenue then, those websites? The general audience website is about 10% of our revenues. 10%? Today, okay. And growing. So where does the other, where does the other 90% come from Because our social networking websites such as Adult Friend Finder. Okay. Because from our live interactive well, video okay. products. But, but remember, we're not, all we do is write software. We do, so, so if LinkedIn or Facebook told you, you could post pictures of yourself however you want, does that make them an adult site? Well, I mean, but but I, even those websites, though, will I mean, Facebook will, will weed out content that may be offensive, though, to others, right? And that's why that's why we have so many websites. It's not you pick and choose which website you want to subscribe to based on what content level you feel is appropriate from what you want. Okay, Mark. Okay, then let me ask you this because you know nobody's going to be able to separate Friend Finder from you know the adults-only content unless you do something drastic, right? Um, Penthouse magazine, I think, contributes like three percent to your revenue. Is, yes. is that about okay? But 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 it is a big brand within Friend Finder. Me, that's what that's the brand that people know. So if you want people to pay attention to more of the general content that you have, um, why not just sell off Penthouse magazine? Yeah. Why not why not do that to unlock the shareholder value that you want shareholders to that you want investors to recognize? With ninety three percent of our revenues being all internet based, the magazine and the broadcast business becomes a smaller and smaller piece of our total revenue. I would foresee at some point in the future we will spin that out and just focus on our internet brands and on our software platforms. So okay. that would not be beyond the realm of reality. You mean to, to spin out Penthouse Magazine? Yes. Would be a possibility? Absolutely. Within the next what? Uh, at some point in the, in the future. In the future? We have, we're talking we have, 12 months? We have bondholder months? covenants that prohibit us from doing it today. Okay. Uh, you know, we're, even though our bonds are rated by S&P, uh, we would be rating on the first lien, triple C plus on the second lien. Right. We still have covenants that prohibit us from spinning off assets. When, once, if those covenants ever get lifted, then we would split it up. Okay. Um, how are you trying to get your structure in place to just you know to tell investors? Because I know what you're trying to do is you're trying to send a different message now to investors that this, we're a software company. We've you know platforms. We're not generating some of the content on our platforms. So how are you putting that structure in place in your company to do that? We're, we're trying to get you to focus on the internet side of our business, on our profitability. I mean, we have about two dollars of cash for free cash flow. We have, <coughs> excuse me, we have 71, 72 million dollars of EBITDA the past 12 months of free cash flow. I mean, we have 112 million of EBITDA, 36 million dollars of interest payments, leaves us 72 million dollars of free cash flow. Okay. That's an enormous amount of free cash flow for a stock that's only four dollars. So, what are you going to do with that cash? We're going to use it for acquisitions. We're going to continue to grow the company. We're going to buy new technologies, okay. and we're going to continue to pay down our debt. And you know, I mean, if you, this company was a roll-up, so. Eight years ago, we had 30 million of revenue with negative 5 million of EBITDA. Today, we have 350 million of revenue with over 100 million of EBITDA. And we got there through rolling up the company. So when you say acquisitions, what are you looking for then? We're looking for new technologies. We're looking okay. at mobile technologies. Uh, things that we can deliver social networking content via mobile platforms is very high on our list of things to do. Okay. Okay. All right. Mark, thank you very much. I appreciate you joining me, thank you for having uh, me. on this. That was Mark Bell, the CEO of Friend Finder.